What's up, everybody? Jace here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2020 uh, Panini Flawless Baseball 2-Box Case Break. Picker Teams number 14 just sold out. And it sold out straight up, guys. Straight, straight up. So, here is the case. And here's a list of custom names I bought in. Arturo getting last one with the Rockies. We were actually going to random number block the last four teams, but they were actually taken before we just, uh, before we were going to random number block them. So, much easier when customers just sell out the whole break. So, there you go, guys. Now it's a full, flawless uh, two-box briefcase break. Which, again, this stuff can be some very, very nice stuff. Spikes. You have bat knobs, bat barrels. Uh, cut autographs, of course, of some very, very big players in MLB history. So let's see what kind of case we get here for you guys today to rip open. So here we go. Try to get some blanks to cover this up. And it looks like no middle card, guys. So, just the two in case cards. If there is ever a middle card, guys, it is going to be a spike or a cleat or something like that. <clears throat> so, good luck, guys. Blockchain right at the bottom, or top, I should say. Boom, boom. All right, first we got is an Anthony Rizzo patch autographs emerald blockchain, which would be going to the uh, Chicago Cubs. <coughs> Cubs would be Zach Gold. All right, we got Bill Dickey out of 15. Four out of 15. Should be New York Yankees. Uh, let me just make sure the checklist is correct, though. Yes, Bill Dickey's Yankees. Next one we got is a little bat, uh, piece of the bat, and it's Joe DiMaggio. How about that? Another one for the Yankees. Go to Andrew. 10 out of 15. Very nice. <laughs> My name's Lil Diggy. There's a lot more to me. I just want to know who I am. I just want to meet the guy. There you go. Guy behind the guy. Ooh, little Mark Grace, Chicago Cubs. Eight out of 20. So, first couple have been Cubs. The next two were Yankees. Ooh, how about this? How about a little one of one? Little patch, star swatches, signatures, Nick Solak. That's what I was about to say, Frank. One of one. Beautiful patch. That is Rangers Daniel with that one. Next one we got 
is a little Jose Ramirez for the Cleveland Indians. Although the Cleveland Indians might not have that name anymore, right? Their nickname's going to be changed. Cleveland. Going to Paul. And we got three out of 15, Jose Altuve. Cleveland baseball team, I know. That's probably what it's going to say. <laughs> All right, Houston. We don't have a problem. Steve, there you go. How about a little MVP of the World Series? Corey Seager, 15 out of 15. Very, very nice. Dodgers, very, very nice. Jay with the Dodgers. Very nice case so far. Our first box, I should say. And 13 out of 25, Don Mattingly. Yankees by far have the craziest checklist, so. Yankees are more likely to pop out in every case. They go Donnie Baseball. All right, let's, let's go with these cards now here. First one we got is the Diamond. Which is 14 out of 20, Cody Bellinger. Piece of the Diamond in there. That would be a great gift for the wife. Take out the Diamond Gem, put it into a little ring or earring. Look at that. Best of both. There you go. And this is just to let you guys know. Diamond guarantee. These are just normal. Let's just let you know that they're not lab grown and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So. There you go. Very nice. Alright. I'm not going to lie guys. I peeked at this one. This one is a crazy patch. Crazy patch guys. You guys ready for this? First of all, it's a one of one. I'll let you guys know that. And we were just talking about this guy, but unfortunately not for the team that we were hoping for. But what about this, guys? How about a Ken Griffey Jr., one of one, with that logo patch right there? Cincinnati Reds edition of Ken Griffey Jr. Should be going to TJ. Jesus. I'm sorry, Frank. I, I mean, I was hoping it was Mariners, man. But I just... I was like, wow. We were just talking about that guy. This is such a beautiful card, though. I'm hoping for some Kyle Lewis for you, though, buddy, in the next half. Look at that, guys. Man. That is a patch, all right. Jeez. Got a little lightheaded right now, man. That was a nice patch. Man. All right. First briefcase. Done. Are you here, Nick? All right, next briefcase. Look at this, Nick. Just turn it around, though. You hit this? Yeah. Dude, I wanted to. <laughs> Dude, this was a hit I was tweeting out. Acting really? Like it was ours. Yeah. That's a sick one. It's on time. the Knight's Lance. Oh, really? Who hit no. this? Um, I think TJ4. Does TJ want to sell it? I don't know. Are you watching TJ? Email us if you want to sell it. Kinda. Yeah. It's sick. Yeah. I gotta post it. So I'll take it. Oh yeah. Signature so clean, patches is amazing. Amazing. Yeah, so Nick Jasby wants to buy it. So when Nick Jasby wants that card, he will pay you a fair price and I'm sure a good amount as well. So if you're, if you're listening, TJ. But this is also another reason why, you know, we, we got to grab right both teams just in case because does suck that Ken Griffey did play for two teams. There's always that possibility. Alright, now 
the blockchain right here at the bottom or top, I should say. Oh, that's got a little unsteady right there. Did he play? Oh, you know what? You're right. He played for the White Sox. But for the most part, I believe most of his stuff is always either Mariners or, or uh, Reds. But yeah, you're right. I think he played for the White Sox a little bit. I think he went back to the Mariners, didn't he? All right, we got Dale Murphy. Great dual Marilia autographs. And Dale Murphy really quick. Braves, I was thinking Braves. All right, cool. So Braves, Dale Murphy. So Atlanta Braves, that is going to Jay. I mean, if there's anything that proves right, I mean, look, guys, I was I was a little baby kid in the '90s, but I did see Ken Griffey Jr. in the early 2000s. But um, if anybody always talks about like the steroid era and all that, with all his major injuries that he just couldn't really fight off, right, with his leg, or not not major injuries, but you know, just nagging injuries. I guess, right, people used to say that there was a main reason there why he probably didn't take any steroids or any enhancing drugs because people didn't take them just to get, just to get like, really buff or, or yoked, right? They did them for recovery, recovery time. So if you had an injury that helped you out, recover much faster. So I think that always kind of shut down the debate. Wow, look at that patch. Max Scherzer, one of one. Little Washington Nationals patch. Very nice. Washington Nationals going to Evan. How about a little triple relic here? Bill Terry, Mel Ott, and John McGraw. Which would be 2 out of 10. And I believe these might be New York Giants. New York Giants. So I will double check, but it should be. I know Mel out for sure would be New York Giants. And I'm assuming the rest of them should be as well. So yeah, Bill Terry's Giants and then John McGraw is also Giants and part of that. So New York Giants, guys. So that'll be going to the San Francisco Giants and Joshua. We got a Aroldius Chapman, 16 out of 20 for the Cincinnati Reds. More Cincinnati Reds editions going out there to TJ. Chris Paddock, 4 out of 20 patch autograph here for the San Diego Padres. Padres, that's going to Logan. Oh, I'll show it to you again right now, Rex. Don't worry. We'll do a quick recap of that. CC Zabathia. Cleveland, 13 out of 25. Houston. Alex Bregman. Three color patch on the top. Dual patches, 14 out of 15. Houston Astros going to Steve. How about some Gavin Lux? That should be a rookie patch autograph, right? 22 out of 25 for the Dodgers. And the last one here is a little polar bear. Pete Alonzo, 1 out of 10. New York Mets. Mets, that is going to Kevin Benedict. There you go, man. A little something right here right before the encase cards. For the Mets. Alrighty, guys. Good luck. Last two right here. Oh, don't bring it up. Come on, Rex. Don't even... We're past that already. Eh. Just hurt it and just put more salt in the wound right now. A one out of five diamond gem of... Uh, Aaron Judge. Aaron Judge. For the Yankees. That is going to Andrew. 
And the last one here, folks. Good luck. This looks like a little emerald red. Wow, it's a dual autograph. And it's 13 out of 20. Pete Alonzo and Jordan Alvarez. So that'll be Houston Astros, Steve, Mets, Kevin. So that'll be a randomizer right there, guys. We'll be randomizing this to one customer there. But of course, the biggest hit we got right here, guys, is this beautiful, beautiful patch autograph, one of one of Ken Griffey Jr. And I could look at this all day. This is it's art right here, guys, for reals. Perfect patch to put in there for a one of one. There you go. So, let's quickly put those teams in a randomizer. Well, the way they're treating Jordan this year is kind of like how they were treating Tatis and Vladimir Guerrero Jr. last year with Flawless. I feel like there was always at least one of those guys in every case. That's right. Fly goes fly, Chris. Finally, a great team win. Wasn't just the offense that did great. The defense did great. Everybody played great. All right, so Mets, Pete Alonzo, and Jordan Alvarez will be Astros. So there you go. Here's the dice roller. And we got ourselves a two and a six eight times. Good luck. Number one gets the dual autograph. Eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Wow, right at the last second. Man, I feel like the Mets were there for pretty much the whole rolls. Eight times, Houston Astros, Steve Locke. There you go. Coming your way. Appreciate it, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.